As the town of Needham moves forward after the pandemic, there's been an emphasis on shopping small and shopping local. To further that effort, the town of Needham collaborated with Newton on Project Pop-Up via the Massachusetts Regional Pilot Program Grant. Part two of our Project Pop-Up coverage, Sea Spray and Shorelines by Starboard, provides an opportunity for just that. Managed by a Needham resident, the pop-up provides another unique retail and art outlet for the community. Project Pop-Up is presented by Upnext, a woman-owned and Newton-based company specializing in pairing emerging brands with vacant retail locations. Located at 1110 Great Plain Ave is one of two pop-up shops in town, Sea Spray and Shorelines. And the proprietor, Ethan Nozell, he's no stranger to the area. Welcome to Sea Spray and Shorelines. Uh, we're located in downtown Needham. I'm actually a local resident. I live on a connecting street in town, which makes it quite convenient. It's very exciting to be here. We are a summer pop-up. Each brand has access to the space for two to three months. So in the case of the two Needham locations, they're both there for just about two and a half months, mid-June through end of August. So the challenge with that is getting it up and running because you're on a limited time frame. You've got 90 days and part of that is set up. Every day matters when you're on a short-term lease contract. You know, it's allowing them to sort of dip their toe in the water of what it's like to have a brick and mortar store without a huge financial risk, I think is such an extraordinary opportunity. I think we all are aware of the effects of the COVID-19 as we come out of it. Uh, so some of the challenges uh, would probably be access to product. There are times where brands that you want don't have uh, materials that you want to invest in. Uh, so you need to reroute, find a substitute, or possibly just another area to fill that category. Uh, I've been fortunate, uh, being in the industry for other reasons, uh, to have a lot of connections. So it's actually worked out quite well. With most rewarding, it has to be the community itself. Uh, this is a first-time uh, opportunity for myself as far as running a store. There are definitely areas where we are learning every single day. There's different situations that come about that you probably don't even think about, like a gift receipt. Um, or possibly do you take Apple Pay? And the great benefits of our community is everyone wants this store to succeed from what I've experienced so far. It seems very positive and we're very fortunate to have the residents and surrounding areas come in. We hope to be able to continue it beyond the end of the summer. So we're sort of fast and furiously behind the scenes looking for other funding opportunities to see if it's something that we can extend. So the arts is a really important part of the culture in both Needham and Newton. And so uh, rather than sort of use the, the storefront windows or incorporate artists in some other way, we wanted to create sort of a gallery experience. Uh, and so we looked at the aesthetic for each space and we had a really great pool of artist applicants and paired them up synergistically to see what would be a fit. With this opportunity, I think it is a, it's, it's great for artists. It's, it's amazing. I feel happy about that my work was chosen among others. I love the way that the coastline theme goes well with the paintings that I hang there. It's really neat to really have a vision of wanting to succeed and making it happen. And we are now here. Uh, where we were three weeks ago is quite different. And it's unbelievably satisfying to really take an idea and turn it into something that people appreciate. It's wonderful. The intent was never to take away from the existing businesses in Needham Center, but rather to supplement and to, uh, again, offer something that would be uh, interesting and new to have people want to come down to Needham Center to check them out. For more information about Sea Spray and Shorelines, pop by the store at 1110 Great Plain Ave give them a call or visit their Instagram page. And for more on Project Pop-Up, visit projectpopup.com. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Jessica Burks.